Right, I'm going to show you how to take an old photo from the 1970s that's all degraded and fix it in Photoshop Lightroom. So we're going to take this photo right here. I'm going to click on it, double click it. It brings it up. Um, you can see it's kind of like on an angle. So we're going to go over here to our function, our crop function, or crop and rotate function, and we're going to click on it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to straighten the photo out. And you can see you've got a little grid that you can do that on to try to get it straight. And we got it pretty good. Uh, you notice that this is a little bit different, so we might just pull this in a little bit to make our outer edge look about the same. Unfortunately, we lose our date. But, hey, what are you going to do? So now we've got our photo. All right, so you can see it's all washed out. So we need to fix that. So we're going to go in here and we're going to edit it. We're going to click on there. Now, you could just go to an auto edit and click here and it would change your photo, but you can see it doesn't do it that very good. It doesn't do that very good. So I'm going to go Command Z that and go back to the original one. And what I usually start off doing, you can see that this is kind of heavily exposed in the front area where he's at from a flash. What I'm going to do is I'm going to come to blacks. So I'm going to pull it down and get it nice and clear. Then I'm going to put a little bit of, a little bit of highlights into it. And then we're going to come down and we're going to get some clarity on it. All right, and when you do that, you're going to notice it pops out of all the imperfections. So now we've got to try to change the color. So it looks a little bit uh, purple, so we're going to bring it the tint down a little bit, and we're going to pull that blue down just a bit. All right, there we go. And you can see it's kind of getting washed out. We can't really get, we're not getting a lot of color out of it. It's still, the temperature looks hot. So we're going to pull that back. And then we're going to dehaze it maybe, or haze it up a little bit. See if we can bring a little bit of color into it. We're just not getting it. We're just not getting it on this photo. Let me pull this all the way down. Pull this down. Nope. Bring it back. So we're having a little bit of a little bit of trouble with that. Let's take some of the noise out of it. Sharpen it. And um, put some contrast into it. And pull this back. So when we pull that back, we can get the primary area here comes out. We can see we get a little bit more color in his face. Let's bring it up a little bit more. See if we can get it. But everything looks pretty purple. So let's pull a little bit more. Let's bring the whites up. We're starting to get a little bit better color in it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to fill the screen. And now what we're going to do is we're going to fill, we're going to fix all these imperfections. And I'm using what is known as the heel tool or heel brush. And you can see here's a here's one here. I'm gonna go across it and then it should just pick something up. I'm gonna click on that one, cross that one, get that one. And this is a very tedious thing that you have to do. But you just gotta go through it like here's a one here, there's one here, one there, one there. And you just go through and you try to get as many as possible and this cleans up your photo. I may have to speed this part up because this is going to take me a while to do. Sometimes it, the computer's pretty good at picking the section that, that you want to cover it, but sometimes it makes a mistake and you have to move it. See how many of these little imperfections are everywhere. And you got to kind of get them. Now when we make the picture smaller, you really don't see a lot of these. But they bug me if I see one. So I got to get as many as possible. And then we got to come back over here. We pull it down. Now we got to find the imperfections here. So here we are. There's so many. Luckily, we don't have a lot. Here's one here on your subject. This picture's from 1974. It's been sitting in a box. It's all washed out, but we can bring it back to life. Or at least try to make it look a little bit better. See, there's many of them over here. So many. 
but we're getting the ones that are important, especially on your subject. You want to make sure your subject's clean. Now here we can go this way, like that. And this one here, we got to pull it back, put it in the center. Where you got one here? Make sure you don't, you know, some things that are, you want to keep in there. The blatant ones you got to get rid of. Let's see. And here's one here. And there's one right there. All right, that looks not too bad. Let's go ahead and get out of that. Let's fit her up. All right, so there's our photo. And we're still a little bit purple on it, aren't we? So let's bring the color up a little bit this way. See if we can change it at all. This one's really giving me a hard time. White balance selector. See if we get anything out of the haze. Still very purple. Pull it down. See the change? Very indefinite. This is about probably as best as we're going to get it. So let's go ahead and take a look at the way it was. That was what we had. This is what we got. So that's you know, we brought it back a little bit. This was almost impossible to get back. Let's look at the color noise reduction. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything. All right, so I think that's going to be the best we're going to get on this one. We could maybe get one more of these. See this right here? Let's get rid of that. All right, done. Here's one here. All right. Oh, we got one more. And I think that's going to do it. So let's go ahead and we'll save that one. We'll click here. And I'm going to save it to the desktop. It's not the best job in the world, but, you know, when you look at what it was and what we got, it's much better. All right. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. And check out my other awesome videos on how to do stuff. Peace out.